Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're back for another video of a news update for both the global and the JP side of Dokkan Battle. Apologies for yesterday for not getting you out the weekly grind video. Uh, I was actually at the beach, so um, I plan on doing it on Monday night, uh, but I couldn't do it Monday night because there was not enough information out about the new events that were going to be available. So I want to at least wait until uh, Wednesday when I got back, but I was so exhausted because I pulled an all-nighter with one of my buddies. Uh, and I, I ended up coming back and just falling asleep. So I am here today for at least a news update of all the data downloads and all the stuff that's currently going on, minus the weekly grind stuff, um, which I'm probably going to release on Friday. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Anyway, as you see on my screen, the Eternal Rivals banner is live on Global. Don't summon on it. It's a trap banner. I don't care if it's 30 uh, stone discount. I'm not even summoning on that one. Um, it has some all right units, but you really don't need it. Uh, wait for the anniversary. The anniversary is going to be out in like another week or two or something like that, most likely. Um, it, I don't have the exact date. I know some people have speculation based off of last year, but just save. You're very, we're very, very close to the third year anniversary, and you definitely want your stones for those banners. Um, so hold off on using stones for that. Preliminary information on the Japan Tanabata campaign that was released 10 hours ago. So we do know the Super Saiyan 4 full power Goku Dokunfest is going to be available on 7-1. That is on Sunday. Um, so I don't know if that means su Sunday night pacific time or if it's going to be like uh saturday night type of thing i think it's going to be like sunday night into monday morning uh so that's probably what's going to happen but it's going to be available on 7-1 the tanabata doken fest is available going to start on 7-7 lr super vegeto and gogeta are now are also going to come back as featured new mentions super saiyan 4 full power goku will be in the banner but with a lower rate um Purunga wish campaign no date is coming up on the jp side and out of 77 ssrs you get to pick seven of the ones that are listed we don't have a date for that either but that's all coming up on the jp side so keep that in mind both the global and the jp side you can go and get your world tournament reward so make sure you log in if you place i got like top 50,000, but uh honestly i stopped playing as soon as i got the mission rewards for all of the uh large potential orbs and then i think i got the five dragon stones just so i can get the additional five dragon stones i think i used one extra dragon stone to get five so i got a four surplus so that's not that bad um, I didn't get the LR Mighty Mask, though. I mean the LR Mighty I, got, I didn't get the Mighty Mask, which I'm a little bit upset about. Uh, I do plan on doing a summoning video for you guys, though, for the Dragon Ball Saga summon tickets. I want to get the, uh, well, actually, I don't have Kami, and I want the new um, uh, Jackie Chun, Intelligence Jackie Chun. That would be a lot of fun to run her as well. Uh, the Gogeta and Vegito cards are now translated. Uh, we're waiting for that to drop on the global side. This is from the French version, so I guess credit to Kawhi. Um, that's going to be awesome. I can't wait for that to come around. Again, I'm probably going to be going for... I think it's the Gogeta banner that I'm going to be summoning on because it has the intelligence of the... Uh, actually, yeah, I think the uh, Gogeta has the intelligence uh, Gogeta on it. Uh, not 100% sure on that one. I'm pretty sure it does. Uh, but that's the one I'm going to be summoning on, most likely because I want... Uh, I think I'm basing it off of how many units I actually have. But again, when, when that banner goes live and we know it's actually going to be on it, I'm going to do a review on that. So make sure you stay around for that. But um, and, and Super End, that's funny. <laughs> I guess, well, French, like, End stands for physical, most likely. Um, free to play Goku and Intelligent Super Saiyan 3 Goku is shown by Kawaii for the global side. So we have that over here. Um, basic stuff, that's going to be the Goku that's going to be coming around. Um, and I don't think we have the Intelligence one out available as of yet. Uh, version 3.11 is being tested for global as well. Uh, there is some rumors around saying that that is going to be for the battlefield. So, I mean, I don't think we're going to get it, guys. Personally, in my opinion, I don't think we're getting it. But you never know. We probably we possibly could be getting the battlefield soon. So that means we get LR Ginyu. I have a box of like 30 freaking SR Ginyus, either awakened to SSR or Z awakened to SSR or waiting to be awakened. So I'm literally just waiting for this damn Ginyu so I can get one so I can max his super damn uh, super attack out. Uh, so that way I can clean up my box of like 30 freaking people. I can't wait for that. Uh, and one other thing, the global side, the contents of the beginner pack is going to be changed. So there's going to be an update there. Uh, we'll have to wait to see what character is going to be there. If it follows JP, it follows JP. If not, you never know. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I probably won't be picking up that pack. But anyway, guys, that's it. Also remember the 120 lead. We should be getting the other stone during the third year anniversary. So that way we could pick a 120 leader. Uh, if you guys are interested in knowing, I'm probably going to pick the 120 Gogeta lead. Uh, I have to wait to see what I summon on on the banner first. And then after I summon on the banner, then I'll make my choice to find out if I'm actually going to get the Gogeta or not. He's the only 120 lead that I'm missing. I personally, I know some of you guys are going to look at me like I'm crazy. I personally would rather have the Omega Shenron dupe because I think like out of all the really good units that I have, I think Omega is the only one that I don't have a good duplicate of. So I might actually do that. Well, again, we'll have to wait and see what happens with that. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me here today. Just want to get that news out to you and I'll catch you all later. Peace.